When it comes to proposals, you'd think we'd seen it all, from flash mobs to popping the question mid-skydive, but 22-year-old Robbie Hayek from Western Sydney has taken romance to another level. He planned the ultimate day-long proposal for his girlfriend, including her favourite music, luxury cars, personalised poetry, horses and a private helicopter. Oh, my goodness. This was a surprise like no other. Behind the fire breather and the drummers, 23-year-old teacher Clarice Matuk is driven in a Lamborghini. This is how she was picked up from work on Friday. After a Lebanese greeting by her family and friends and a send-off from her dad, Clarice got a red carpet to a private helicopter. And this was just the start. Landing in Glenworth Valley, Clarice enjoyed a horse ride through the bush and poems written by her boyfriend along the way. This will be the last card before your surprise, so please take this photo in front of the tree and blue skies. <laughs> With her favourite song playing, six months of planning came down to this moment. Robbie got a yes from the love of his life. We got a yes from the beginning of the day. <laughs> and as if the day couldn't get any more romantic, Robbie had one last surprise. We're going to meet Koshi on Sunrise Monday. Ah, Koshi! <laughs> <laughs> I don't understand a word he says about finance, but I love everything else about <laughs> It was the perfect proposal for a happily ever after. Oh, it's still going on. <laughs> it's still going. Oh, the happy couple join us now. Let's welcome them in. quietly and without much fuss? I do. <laughs> <laughs> Here's a different story. <laughs> so you had no idea I this was happening? I had no idea. I went to work, a normal day at work, and then I came out and that was what I saw. Whoa. To escort me out. <laughs> it's me. Robbie, yeah. you're a romantic, aren't you? I like to think I am. <laughs> you're 22. Yes. You're at uni. Yes. How, do you afford, how did you afford to do all of this? Well, as we said, the guys, I had um, events by Ellie and Vibe Entertainment. The guys are great. They're doing an awesome job. Reasonable price. And they put on a show, as we saw today. Right. Yeah. <laughs> Wow. Yeah. I, I didn't even know what so was going on. If, if this isn't you, when all this happened, do you think, oh, <laughs> did you have second thoughts by the no. end of it? No, no, no. I was, I was waiting for... I wasn't expecting this extravaganza, but I was waiting for the proposal. Right. I was, so what on earth are you going to do for your wedding? Oh. Keep it small. Yeah. <laughs> I'd like to keep it small. Really? I think we'll be on sunrise in a couple of years after no. the wedding again. <laughs> Oh. No, no. So you got to put your foot down now. Yeah. You got to say, yep, no need to compete. Keep, yeah, no need no. to keep getting it bigger. No, keep it small. Yeah. And you've set the, the bar pretty high for other Aussie blokes. Poetry, my goodness. Yeah. yeah. Well, it's a thing. It's a thing I normally do for her. Yeah. I've written a few poems throughout our relationship, and for the past right. year, she's been asking me, "Oh, can you update the poem?" And I said, "Yeah, you're going to get a, a nicer poem." Yeah. And it was on a big day. Do you have brothers and sisters? Yes, I do. Younger. Sur surrounded by sisters. No, I make you do this. It's mainly boys in the family. Is that right? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, wow. yeah. pick that. Goodness me. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well done. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you very, Thank you very well much. Done. It's been crazy. <laughs> it's true. <laughs>
understated, Eddie, isn't it? Eddie, have you Eddie. cope with that? Oh, jeez, Neil, you better be taking notes. If I don't get a Lamborghini and a 512er, it's a no. <laughs>